everybody, hope you're all having a wonderful day today. Today, guys, I have in front of me the Loot Crate Magical World of Harry Potter box. So I'm gonna be opening that up today. It's been sitting here for a couple of days and I've just been really antsy to get into it. So let's do that. This month's little sticker thing is different from the usual lock. And I think this month's theme is dark magic or something along the lines of that. And look, the inside is different too. All right, looks like we have a t-shirt in here. What is it? We've lived in the shadows for too long. Guys, I have not seen Fantastic Beasts yet. I don't know what's wrong with me. I went and bought it from Target the other day, so I need to hurry up and get on that. Maybe I'll do that tonight. I'm inspired now after getting this shirt that I don't know who the character is. Do you guys ever do that? Like, I'm a huge, huge fan of Harry Potter, but for some reason, I have not seen the Fantastic Beast movie, and it's been out, like, forever. What is my dog doing back there? She sees herself in our mirror. <laughs> Poor thing, probably thinks she has a new friend. Anyway, let's get into the next item. What is this? Stationary wax stamp set? Oh. Is that one of those wax stamper that Well, obviously that's what it says, huh? Guys, I have seen the Harry Potter wax seals um, at Barnes and Noble and stuff whenever I go, and I always want them. I don't know why, I just think it'd be fun to do like a little wax stamp thingy. Then at the same time, it'd be very hard for me to melt the wax, because I like things to stay just perfection, <laughs> looking brand new. Let's see, what's this? So here's this little pouch first. Oh, that is so cool. This is so cool, guys. I'm gonna be making all kinds of wax stamps here. <laughs> and what will you be stamping, you ask? This right here are the slithering snakes from the Chamber of Secrets. All right, now what's inside this little plastic thingy? This was also in the wax set. Oh, okay, so they're cards. So it's a stationary set of the wax and the stamp and one, two, six cards with the same seal here and then six envelopes. So, you know, you can write somebody a fancy letter, seal it with wax and, and you can feel all kinds of fancy, like I will. What is this? Oh my gosh. These are, the <laughs> this is hilarious. Oh. <laughs> we have a four piece plate set of these cats, these are so hideous. This is hilarious. Um, Dolores Umbridge. I think she is the character that I just loathe the most in Harry Potter. And uh, you know, her, her fancy feline set. <laughs> but this is fantastic. I get to add to my plate set. And people who don't watch Harry Potter or don't remember Dolores Umbridge's horrible, horrible plates. I'll be serving them snacks on these for sure. This is hilarious. Guys, I cannot get over how tacky these are. And people are gonna be coming over and they're gonna be like, why do you have cat plates? You don't like cats. Sorry guys, I had, had a psycho cat when I was a kid and now I'm terrified of them, so <laughs> dog person. But anyway, yeah, I'm so excited to have these in my home though. It's just the cats mixed with these oh, floral borders. They're so good. This one's wearing a sweater. How do you get a sweater on a cat without getting scratched up? I know there's some nice cats. Those must be really nice cats. And then if you look at this one, there is a cat plate in the background of this photo. <laughs> anyway, I feel that my house just got way more... I don't even know what to say. It is an Azkaban prison pouch. Store some pencils in here. Store makeup brushes, in my case, probably. Oh, oh it smells weird. Oh, why do I keep smelling it, though? Whew, okay, I'm gonna let this one air out for a while because it has some some weird scent to it that I don't really care for. Let's see, do makeup brushes fit in here? I'm almost scared to put my makeup brushes in here with a stink. Let's see. That one fits. That one fits. That is fantastic. I'll be able to take this traveling with me. Mm -hmm. Cool. It looks like we are down to the last item, which happens to be the pin, of course. And what will be on this pin? We may never know if I cannot open this. There we go. Ready? I'll show you guys first. Whoop. What is it? It's the diary. It is the diary. All right, guys. Here it is. Here is the diary. 
and then it has it to where you could just stick it through. Bam! That's cool. That is neat. I think out of all the Loot Crate pins that I've ever received, which there are a ton, I think this one right here is the coolest because, you know, it just, it works. <laughs> Blammo, right there, just destroyed it. It's a very large pin too. And then of course, at the very bottom of the thing, like this one looks like an envelope, um, you have the spoiler sheet or just, you know, the sheet that says what everything is. Uh, yes, this month's box was dark art. I thought this was a fantastic box. Those plates are hilarious. That pouch is gonna come in handy. That pin was really awesome and I cannot wait to get started on stamping stuff with that wax seal and there's just gonna be things stamped all over the place. I have letters to write. People are gonna end up with letters from me and they're gonna be like, what, why? And she'd be like, hey, how's the weather? Oh, I know how it is because I live like two feet away from you. Just wanted an excuse to send out this wax sealed envelope. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this boxing. How many of you guys are Harry Potter fans? Raise your hand, boop, or just like leave a little me in the comments or something, and I'll know what you're talking about. Uh, anyway, what do you think about this box? Do any of you guys have the Harry Potter box? What's your favorite item? What is my favorite item? Probably the wax stamp set because stationary. Um, I don't know. It's a hard decision though. There's so many good things in this box. I want to know what your favorite item is. Let me know. And uh, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please thumbs up. Please subscribe if you've not already. And until next time, guys, goodbye. Mwah.